member for Nanaimo, Kalachik. Mr. Speaker, today UNICEF released a report on rates of child poverty that ranks Canada in the bottom third of industrialized countries. The report pulls no punches and says that the child poverty rate shows up in stunted individual potential, higher social cost, and dimmed economic prosperity for all. Will this government live up to its responsibilities under the UN Convention on the Rights of the Child and act now to end child and family poverty? The Honourable Minister for Human Resources. Well, Mr. Speaker, in fact, our government has done exactly that. In fact, Mr. Speaker, the rate of child, the percentage of children in poverty is half under our government than it was under the Liberals. And why is that, Mr. Speaker? Because we've done a lot of things that the NDP voted against, such as enhancing the national child benefit and the child tax benefit. Yep. This year we're investing $19 billion in support of children. They're voting against it. We introduced the universal child care benefit that's taken 55,000 children out of the lower income bracket. They voted against that. We've improved that for single families. They're voting against it too. Mr. Speaker, we're there. We're helping children get out of poverty. Too bad the NDP wouldn't join us in that effort. For London West. Mr. Speaker.